Mizu, hello, congratulations. Can you hear us first off? Yep, I can hear you guys. Awesome. Can okay. you hear me? Yes, 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 we can hear you, we can hear you. Okay, Denog, this time I'm starting with questions. I Go am on. firstly... I, I was very intrigued about the Razor pick. When when I was seeing it, when you guys initially drafted it, I was intrigued what your thought process was. Was it initially you guys were wanting to play it as a position three? Were you keeping it open? Were you thinking it was going to be played mid versus the Ember? When, when did you really decide of, of the position for it? I think when we picked it, we already decided that it was going to be like a flex pick for like all three of us because it's good against the Ember mid first of all and their supports can't really do anything to the Razor once he gets a BKB regardless of the role yeah I think that's when we decided where to put our Razor and take it it's a very strong hero right now this patch as well yeah I'm the build looks exceptionally crazy with how you're able to just control multiple heroes which is be lining at them and BKB statically they can do nothing and I mean I think Denog and I can both say we've been growing a fan of you through the past year or so when we've really seen you grow into this position three role i mean you've it just felt like it, it really feels like it's your home we, we see you turn games around on, on heroes like the dark sea we've seen you build new heroes as well like you know the razor we haven't seen you play the earth shaker till earlier on in this division and i'm just intrigued on like maybe a new player that's looking to swap roles like what were some of the main things you focused on were you watching a lot of replays were you playing a lot of pubs was there anything you were doing uh, at a higher level than the others i think i was like playing a lot of pubs at the beginning and if i do not know how to play like a certain hero like maybe at the start you know i do not really know how to play Darkseer. so i was like looking at my control see like how he plays Darkseer, how he plays the lane and everything like that because the hero is like kind of hard to play right now especially with all the like strong dominant safe laners mm. yeah that's how i ease myself into the off lane position just so what you're saying watching is, and playing. Uh, yep. i just need to have open my friends list and have a look at what you're playing in pubs and that's what we can expect to see in, <laughs> uh, in, in the next little bit i won't reveal anything but uh you know again Big congratulations on uh, the win, going 4-0 into the holiday break. But wh what are you guys going to plan to do over that sort of period? I know previously you felt like you were playing in every single tournament that you got the opportunity to, but you've taken a step back now. Does that mean that you're just going to have a period where you're not even scrimming at all over the uh, the holiday period, where you get to you know go and see some family, or is it something else? Uh... For Singaporeans, we are kind of like with our family for most of the time. But I think everyone is like going going to take a break for a bit because like we don't really have tournament until like next year, like early next year. So like there's no reason for us to like scream so hard because there might be, even be a patch, right? Who knows? Right. Like that's something we would we will have to see. But yeah, I think most of us are going to just take a break for a bit and then come back, refresh and you know more motivated than ever and try to uh play for the upper division yeah absolutely i mean that, that was the thing that really came out from our uh previous interview that we had with polison was that the real reason that we saw a little bit of a drop in your performance let's say three months ago was just due to that motivation so do you feel like having that complete break is gonna provide you with that little bit of an extra boost that you need to be hungry again once the the dpc starts up again in the new year actually for us i think it's every time we take a break we come back we actually lose to everyone <laughs> I, that's what i realized from our mm -hmm. team at least so i'm not too sure if like a break actually is what we need but i think forcing everyone to like play all the way until the new year is like a really long time and just not I, I don't think that's like the thing to do, regardless. Makes sense to me. Well, uh, cool. Um, you were mentioning the patch. Uh, let's say that uh, Ice Frog or Gaben might be listening in. Is there anything that you want to put on your wish list for, you know, a holiday present maybe? Mm, let me think. I can't really think of like. What do you hate coming up against? He I wants, hate Weaver, He wants Naga as a viable three. That's what he wants. That's true, actually. That would be uh, good for you. <laughs> give Naga a song talent, that would be nice. Yeah, that, that would actually help her, you know, at least try to play in the offlane role. 
But mm, I think those certain safe laners, I guess, like there are quite a lot of really strong safe laners right now in the patch. So my dream is to not play against all, any of those, like Razor especially. Yeah, sounds good to me. All right, well, thank you very much for joining us again, uh, Mizu. And uh, have they have they actually fixed your uh, your portrait in game again? I, I know they fixed it last time around, but then they they still messed it up this time around to get it. They fixed it again. I think so. All right, good, good. That's what we want to see. Let's go. Real, real Miz is showing. Congratulations once again. Even though you're uh, apparently versing very difficult safe lane heroes, it seems to be that you are dominating a majority in all of the games here. You guys 4 and 0 to kick off Division 1. It's been a treat to watch. Enjoy the break. Come back even stronger for the uh, second half of the, uh, the season. Thank you very much for joining us. Thanks for the interview. Bye-bye. Thanks, Mizu.